What is up my friends? Toby Wayne from Toby Wayne Studios. Today I thought that I would show a couple pieces that I um, have uh, done over the years that I've actually had signed by celebrities or uh, the slasher icons uh, over in the history of movies. Um, and I've been very fortunate and blessed to be able to have met a lot of these guys. Uh, and so here's a couple that I've uh, met. Um, this one here is my uh, Death Curse bust. Um, this is an earlier paint variant. Uh, this was one of the first ones that I did. But anyway, I had met uh, Kane Hodder at uh, Crypticon 2009, I think it was. Or no, 10, excuse me, 2010 in Seattle. Uh, it was really awesome. Uh, he was kind enough to sign this bust for me here. Um, and then he was ultra nice to, uh, saw, he had seen that I had um, a bunch of these at the table. And so he was kind enough to uh, put his uh, uh, signature and autograph there on this, uh, these magnets. Uh, so um, I decided to keep this one because, you know, it was, was kind of cool, you know. And I was honored and flattered that he took the time to sign all of those without... Uh, any second hesitation or thought he's just like hey are those you know well, those are cool Can, you want me to sign some of those like, yeah so anyway yeah it was really cool he he uh uh signed uh, this uh uh death curse bust and a bunch of these magnets and i believe this is the last one that i have uh, kind of my own personal uh magnet so uh this one sits proudly out in the studio uh so that's that was uh, really awesome meeting him uh, one of the second pieces that I had signed was this um, Sickness Rising um, zombie bust. This thing is about 12 inches tall, and I was at uh, Emerald City, and I don't remember what year it was, um, maybe 12 or 13, if I remember it right. But anyway, um, I had the privilege of having uh, Tony Moore... Uh, who is the illustrator for the first Walking Dead uh, comic books uh, signed this. And it was interesting because um, he had, uh, unbeknownst to me, he had come by my table um, like after, you know, after the show, uh, you know, right before we were closing and I, none of us were there. Uh, but he had said, uh, when I came up to him and asked him, hey, would you be interested in, you know, can I get you to sign this? And uh, he's like, oh yeah, I, I, you're, you're the sculptor that's over on the far side. So that was awesome that he uh, knew my work um, and uh, it felt like a real jerk. It was funny because there was this line of about a hundred people because he told me, he says, just come back towards the end of the, at the end of the show and um, you know, and I'll get, I'll get you in. And I says, okay. So I go and I stand in line and there's probably about you know, anywhere from uh, probably 60 people, 70 people maybe. There was a lot of people in line waiting for him. And I'm standing at the back of the line just waiting my turn and he sees me and we make eye contact and he motions for me. And I'm um, I'm just like, no, he's not talking to me, you know. And, and <laughs> he looks at me again and he's like, you, come here, you know. And I'm like, me? And he's like, yeah, you. <laughs> and I felt like a real tool. And then I felt like a real jerk because I cut in front of all those people and he took the time to uh, sign this. So I, I was honored um, and thankful that he signed it, but I felt like a real jerk cutting in front of everybody. So uh, I, to those of you that were at that show and you see this video, I humbly apologize. That was not my intention was to cut in front of you. So, uh, and then this is my, probably my, the holy grail of uh, my sculptures that I've had signed um, by people. Um, so this is my uh, Gluttony the Clown bust. Um, this is special f to me for a lot of different reasons. Um, this was my very first, one of my first resin kits that I had actually uh, figured out how the resin works and the silicone and all that stuff. So this was, this was the, one of the first ones that I had done. Um, but anyway, I, at uh, Crypticon 2009, um, I had the privilege of meeting Sid Haig from uh, Captain Spaulding from The Devil's Rejects, House of a Thousand Corpses, uh, and his acting career is uh, amazing and it goes, goes back a long ways. Um, but anyway, uh, he was ultra kind uh, to sign this and he was, he was quite a, a character, a very, very nice uh, gentleman. Um, but uh, yeah, so we talked for a little bit and uh, he signed this for me. 
But uh, what makes this piece ultra special is uh, it would be, I, I think, a year later, um, I was doing some uh, with my buddy uh, David and my wife Katie. We were doing some makeup uh, for the Extreme Home Makeovers uh, show when they came to Salem at the Oregon School for the Deaf, uh, the Nightmare Factory. Um, anyway, um, Rob Zombie was there. And I, I don't even know how or why, but I ended up having this bust there. I had no idea he was even there, but anyway, um, he was there. And so I ended up uh, having him sign uh, this bust. So, I mean, I, it was totally unplanned, totally, I was blown away at the fact that uh, Rob was there. Um, I had no idea that he was going to be there, um, and I and I don't even know why I even had this bust with me. Uh, it was very bizarre. But anyway, needless to say, uh, I'm incredibly thankful, and this one is under lock and key in the studio. Uh, Sid Haig, Captain Spaulding, and of course Rob Zombie, uh, who uh, I don't even need to introduce who he is. Uh, if you don't know who he is, look him up. Um, but yeah, so this is my... Uh, this is my uh, holy grail of the of my collection for signed pieces, and I have autographs and other pictures and stuff signed. But for th these specific, um, you know, pieces and stuff, I I wanted to have signed, and and I did. Um, and I do have uh, oh, and and I do have, uh, and I covered this in another video, but I have this uh, Freddy Krueger bust also signed by Robert England. So. What a what a uh, collection uh, that I was fortunate enough to get uh, these guys to sign my sculpts. I'm very thankful, and uh, so yeah. So anyway, I just wanted to make this quick video to kind of uh, you know show you guys what I had uh, in my collection of, of horror related um, items and what I had signed and and all that good stuff. So anyway, uh, yeah. If you guys have questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the the comment section below. I always love hearing from everybody. If you've got a, a awesome uh, Holy Grail in your collection, uh, leave that comment in the comment section below and tell me about it. I always love to hear what other uh, collectors uh, have gotten and their experiences uh, with uh, celebrities. So anyway, thank you guys so much for checking this out. You can also check me out on Instagram, uh, Toby Wayne Studios over there. I, I would appreciate the follow. So uh, anyway, until the next video, go, uh, video, you guys are awesome and thank you so much and I will catch you in the next video.